the Midnight Journey, a very special event prepared by the Almighty for the Prophet and Messenger Muhammad, peace be upon him, to soothe his heart from the grief that filled his heart after the death of his most beloved and closer souls in life, his wife Khadija and his uncle Abi Talib, during the time where he was offended from his tribe in the same year, during these days before Ramadan, by almost one month and three days, where he called that year the year of sorrow, the Almighty's will to show his messenger maximum love and to let him acknowledge how much he is beloved and cared for from the Lord, from the angels, and from the people of the heavens, including the preceding prophets and messengers of God. Allah's will is to host his messenger, peace be upon him, to make two journeys, accompanied by Jabril, the angel. The first one starts from Mecca, at the sacred mosque Kaaba, to the farthest mosque in Jerusalem, where the past prophets and messengers of God, from Adam to the latest prophets preceding him, we are waiting in Jerusalem, in the farthest mosque, to cherish him and pray with him under his leadership. He headed to the second journey, leaving the farthest mosque in Jerusalem and heading with Jabril the angel, passing through the heavens and further beyond the heavens and beyond the seventh layer of the heavens, to a level and a degree where no one and no prophet or messenger before him has reached that degree even Jabril, the angel himself. All the journeys, arrangements, possibilities, limits were prepared by the almighty of Allah's power, capability, extent, and will. That's why it is one of the gifts and the miracles just provided and specified to the messenger, Muhammad, peace be upon him, and all the prophets and messengers of God, Allah.